Scott, we're here with a new video. We're going to talk today about building your list. I think that one of the biggest questions that I get when people are brand new to the digital product world, marketing, you know, internet marketing world is totally. how do I build a list? So take us in, man. I know that you've got yeah, something good for us. Absolutely. We, we have a new way to do that on Samcar, which is really fun, right? But, but really, the answer has been forever, right, is give something away in exchange for email addresses. Like, that's the answer. You know yeah. what I mean? You give away a, a freebie, a checklist, a lead magnet. It's a lot of different names, right? Mm -hmm. But the really cool thing is we have a new way to do it on Samcart, and we also have AI to help you out to make it happen, which is really, mm -hmm. really fun. So let me go ahead. I'm going to show my screen. I think everybody can see that now. Um, and I'm just going to demo how to do this actually now inside of Samcart. So every single Samcart account now has the new page builder, right? And it's our new, um, you actually can see the banner for it right there. It's yeah, an AI this page is still, builder. It's still in beta. It's still in beta. But we've got, thou I mean, literally tens of thousands of customers are using this thing every day. It's a lot of fun. Definitely go check it out. I've made some pages. You'll see some pages I've already made here. But right now, I'm just going to click Create New and just demo how quick the AI builder can spit these things out, right? So you can see I can build a checkout page. I can build a lead capture, which is that's what we're going to do, uh, a landing page, or a link in bio. Mm -hmm. And all these pages have like Sam Cardi Commerce baked in. There's a lot of good things going on. I'm just going to choose lead capture for this purposes of the demo right here, right? So, and I'll just call this lead capture example, right? But what's going to bring up next are going to be templates that are designed for this purpose. So cop, mm -hmm. you're out there all day talking on social media. You know what I mean? You're out there mm -hmm. interacting with your audience and every once in a while you can say, hey, by the way, if you want this thing, right? Hey, my free checklist. Hey, my, you know, seven day keto meal plan, you know, whatever yep. it is, click the link in my bio and go get it, right? And you can and have a this link is where them. that link will take them to exactly. You're gonna grab the link to this right page now. right here. Yep. So here's some quick, um, here's some quick like, just some quick templates, right? Mm -hmm. And the really cool part about it, the AI page builder is that like it, you just pick a layout that you like, right? And then watch this is I can immediately change the entire look and feel of these pages just by applying some different styles, mm -hmm. right? And it automatically changes the spacing. It changes the colors. It changes the fonts. It changes everything, right? Just by quickly applying some of these things. And I actually don't love any of these. So I'm just going to pick one and show mm -hmm. you. You can save and make your own. We'll kind of get to that in a second. But right now, I like the layout of this page. I'm perfectly fine with how this looks, right? Mm -hmm. I'm going to click on next and keep going. And so the next thing you can do is if you wanted to add more content to this page, right? You've got all these things. We call them templates, right? But basically think of like pre-done sections that you sections, can Sections, modules. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, 100%. So like I might take like an FAQ, you know, module and drop it down here at the bottom and say like, all right, cool. I got an FAQ module. Yeah. I might come down here and say, you know what? I know uh, there's a navigation like footers, right? So cool. Maybe I want to add a footer to the bottom, right? Mm -hmm. But whenever you're good, right? This looks good. I like how this looks, right? Actually, I can even delete a section. So if I have this section right here and I say, cool, mm -hmm. I don't like that, right? You can do all this stuff here, right? The really fun part is when we talk about AI design, and this is uh, what's kind of baked in all throughout SamCard stuff is all these sections, like this section at the top, right? If I click done, let me go ahead and just click done, right? Now, what you'll see is my content of the page is on the left and the AI is giving me a page preview on the right. Right. Yeah. And so up here, I have a headline. I've got a quick tag. I've got a sub headline. I've got my form. I've got an image. Right. What happens if I drop in some more content? Right. So if I go ahead and click uh, new line over here and drop in a second image mm -hmm. by searching image, I drop a new image component and then I can use a bunch of, uh, you know, really high quality unsplashed Getty images, you know, yeah. whatever. Um, let me just look for I'm going to search for report and see what we find and say, all right, cool. Uh, I like this image right here, right? I'm gonna mm -hmm. add some new content. Basically, all I'm saying is you can add and remove all kinds of different content by mm -hmm. individual components, add more text, add a bullet point, add whatever, right? And the AI design engine just redesigned everything based on the new stuff. Yep. So it resizes mm -hmm. your images, it, it drags some stuff around, right? I can, if I don't like this design, I can hit the magic wand and just go click, 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 click until it's going to, the AI design engine basically reimagines all kinds of different designs until I find one that I really love, right? And so, and at any point you can change the colors, you can change the spacing, you can change all kinds of things here. And so when we say AI design, that's what we're talking about, right? Yeah. And so I'm gonna leave that one right there. I think that's kind of cool. I told you before you could change the fonts and the themes of the whole thing, right? Mm -hmm. If I come to the sidebar and click on themes right here, right? I've got a ton more themes I can go apply and I click one button 
and it applies that theme to the entire page, changes all the fonts, all the styling, everything all at once. That's why this thing is, you know, AI design. Or I can apply my own themes that I've created before, right? And I really like that one. I'm just gonna stick with this one right here. And so that's all I mean, like creating these pages, right? Actually really soon, Sam Cart's gonna be able to write the whole page for you, which is crazy. Like have AI give some like prompts and stuff and let it write your whole page. Coming soon, not here right now. Um, but really quick, let's take a look at this lead capture form right here. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about this. Now I need to deliver the promise. Like, let's say I'm gonna mm -hmm. give away, um, you know, download my, uh, you know, real estate report. I don't know, I, I have this PDF on my on But yeah, my you desktop. got a PDF, you got a, you got a, a download. Of, yeah, so, I've got something yeah. in my downloads yeah. folder or whatever like that, I'm gonna give away. I wanna give it away to somebody the moment they do this, and mm -hmm. I wanna take their email and name and deliver them to like my email tool. MailChimp or ConvertKit or yeah, HubSpot for using it, whatever, something like that. So in order to de to deliver that download automatically, SimCard can take care of it for you, right? We come over this lead capture component over here on the left. And I'm gonna just scroll over until I see the settings gear. Right? Okay, so it's in the form settings. Exactly, you yeah. go to the form itself, right? And here's where you can control what are you gonna collect, right? Uh -huh. Name, email, phone number. You uh -huh. can make things required, not required, whatever, right? I'll just go with just email for the purposes of keeping it easy. Mm -hmm. And then after submitting, you choose to say, cool, here's a message. So I could say, hey, thanks for joining, right? Or thanks for downloading, mm -hmm. right? Or I could redirect to a totally different page. Yep. So maybe you want to redirect to, I don't know, you well, want to redirect to like call page or, yeah, or a sales page or yep. a webinar or something like mm -hmm. that. Great, right? But here's the cool part too, is I can actually upload my digital download right here. Yeah. So I'm going to take that report cop that I wanted to go give away, right? And where was it? It was in my downloads. There we go. Cool. Yeah. So I would just add a quick, a quick, uh, drag and drag. Yeah. Drag it in there. Right. Uh -huh. Downloads. Good. Welcome to real estate. You can technically replace the file if you want. You can do all kinds of stuff. And then any other tools you've connected to SamCart, right? SamCart has our app marketplace where you connect with your tools for email or, you know, analytics or, you know, whatever, right? Is I can create rules right here that basically say, all right, cool, let's go to, I wanna make sure that I add people to MailChimp mm -hmm. when they s submit this form, right? So I'll say, cool, I'm going to add them to a list in MailChimp. I'll search for different, if I only have one list in this MailChimp account, if I had more, you'd see more. And yep. I'd say, cool, when someone submits this form, right, I want you to add them to a list in MailChimp and that's the list I want you to add to. And you click add rule and you're done. What, what I wanna highlight here is you don't have to go and create a form in your email marketing platform, copy and paste the embed code here. You can use the form directly in the page builder exactly. and then connect it directly to your list. 100%, right? you're just yeah. creating that really simple rule. It's like yeah. using Zapier or something, mm -hmm. right? And all you're doing is setting a rule. When someone submits this form, I want you to add a tag inside of ConvertKit. I want you mm -hmm. to add a list in MailChimp. I want you to you know, run this action in HubSpot or something like that, right? Yeah. I click publish, I come back to this page, right? And let's test this out. So if I do, you know, kind of one of my like throwaway Gmail addresses here, and I click download now, right? It says, hey, cool, awesome, thanks for downloading. I download the file, right? It opens up, let me open it up in my uh, whatever. Welcome to real estate, there's my PDF. Yep. So you have grown your list. This person is added to your list. Sam card is automatic value immediately. Yep. It, absolutely. Already mm -hmm. recognize the value. They've got a PDF. You've grown mm -hmm. your list. You've got a super exciting new person in your world, right? And all of that done, right? With this very exciting new AI page. In like two there. minutes. In like two minutes, a yeah. lot of talking, you know what I mean? So stay yeah, tuned, right. this is yeah. only gonna get yeah. better. It's in beta, like we said, start using it, send your feedback to us, but that's how you're gonna give away a free lead magnet and grow your list using the new SamCart AI page builder. Sure.